What is going on guys? I show it too hard here. And as you see, I am battling the Eater of Worlds right here. He is a boss of the worm type, as you can tell. Um I the way you get him to appear is by um <coughs> destroying three shadow orbs and I did that on or I destroyed one shadow orb uh during one of the things I did for game reviews and more so if you want to see how to do that I uh, go ahead and I will put a link in this description uh, if it is up by the time this goes up if not um, I will just keep you guys up to date on all that stuff and this guy has a lot of health I'm not gonna lie he has a lot of body parts, he's really big, and each body part has 200 health, so that's, uh, did he disappear? Oh, no. She's lagging a little. Why am I dropping so many frames? If I die again, I'm gonna be mad. He's got about 100 life left on some of the things. I actually saw that 90, which is looking very promising. Ow. He just like curls around and does a bunch of stuff, so it'll take about a couple more times for him. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, alright. What are you doing now, bro? Gotta kill all that? Jesus. Are there like five of them? Come on. Shadow scale, eh? I need some bombs or grenades. That'll work. That'll work. Throw some grenades. Do I have any bombs or anything like that? No, I got some muskets as well um, during that. Um, th God dang it! If it restarts all the way over, I'm going to be so mad. I'll be so mad if it does. Alright, that looking promising. Not Why? Oh my god. This guy is still so long, though, which is kind of annoying, but, you know, it is a boss, so you can't really expect it to be easy, can you? There we go, there we go, working. Ow! How? How am I dying? It... I don't get this. Get out of my house, bro. Alright, here we go. Come on. Work on him, work on him, work on him. Here we go. The only bad thing, you have to kill a lot of them to kill them, I guess. And then he just splits up into two. But I'm um, got a feeling I can do this. This is a pretty easy compared to the um, Eye of Cthulhu. Because the Eye of C Cthulhu guy, he, as soon as you die, he just disappears. This guy, he doesn't disappear, which is good. Because I'm dying a lot. But luckily, it's right next to my spawn. So I can just go and poop on him again. Not really. I'm getting pooped on myself. Did you leave? No. I'm about to be so mad if you left. Come on.
he actually seems easier if you die more and more because now he's not as long and there's only him or the main one now I guess I don't know what I'm saying but it is gonna get much harder as he gets smaller and smaller so but that is what where are my shurikens are sunk shurikens these are pretty good I almost killed uh, what's his name the I've Cthulhu with these and arrows and stuff like that if you guys remember or not or I don't know if I'll post that or not I don't know and now the Eye of Cthulhu is going to be coming after me soon, too. Nice. If I have to fight two bosses at once, I'm going to be mad. Oh, I almost died there. Again. That could have been a... That was an avoided death. Got a lot of shadow scales and quite a few amount of money. Which is not bad. Um, where'd he go? Oh, stop running away, bro. I'm waiting for you. Oh, man. It's taking a long time just to kill him. Like, he's not that hard, he's just... He's got a lot of health, that's the only problem. Let's see... I have Cthulhu has awoken? Why? Why did you awake, I have Cthulhu? I did not do anything to you. I've, oh my god, this is unbelievable. <laughs> Shooting him with my musket. Get out of here, Jesus. I kind of want to just die just so this guy can get away from me. Just go ahead and kill me, bro. <laughs> Eater of Worlds has been defeated. I don't know how. But I'll take it. I better find his demonite ore. Where is it? Um, I'm going to be mad if I can't get to it, that's for sure. Um, does it just appear in my, oh, it does. Nice. And oh yeah, the, um, this weird altar that I'm going to, it is a demon altar. It is where you create demon, demonite, um, armor stuff like that I'm pretty sure uh, but first you gotta smelt it I guess oh and there's been iron there the whole time are you kidding me wow I feel dumb I didn't I'm surprised that that even counted as me killing it because I know I did not kill it I just um survived I guess I don't know so I got nine demonite ore. I can make a bow, which is not that great. Ooh, and I can make unholy arrows. That's pretty cool. And let's just make some copper just to sell it to this guy. Uh, shop. Um. Dang. Uh, I got like three muskets. So yeah, let's sell you, you, you. 
Um, yeah, that seems pretty good for now. Let's go get that fallen star. Now I gotta make another room for the druid guy. Or a girl. At least I think I do, I don't know. At least I, th I think she'll come if I do. We shall see. Meteor has landed, yes! Yes! Oh man, this is lucky ducky day. Or I guess, I don't know what those are for then. Maybe... I don't know. I didn't even look at the wiki. I just saw a video with it, and he called it a demon, demon knight, a demon altar. Um, so I just guess that's what they did, but I guess they don't. So now I shall go look for that meteorite. Uh, do I have the obsidian helm or skull on? Yes, I do. So now I can go mine some meteorite and make some awesome weapons and armor and stuff like that, which is always nice. Um, but actually, first I'm going to make the one girl's house really quick, just so that while I'm go away getting my um, thing of what uh, meteorite, I can let this girl move in and walls all right so how are you guys liking this series uh, this will probably be episode 15 I want to say somewhere around 15 to 16 uh, I'm not exactly